What's up, y'all? It's Julian Gordon from the Multifamily Movement, aka your property brother, aka Mr. Multifamily. And right behind me is the first property that I ever bought right here in Brooklyn, New York. This three family home. Bought it in May of 2013. And uh, this was the property that set it off for me. This was the beginning of my portfolio, okay? I want you to get out of the mindset of only having one property or being a quote unquote home owner. No, I want you to think about having a portfolio, not just one property. Now, for some of you who live in expensive cities like New York or San Francisco or Los Angeles, um, I want you to recognize something real quick is that your money does not have to work in the same city as you do your money does not have to work in the same city as you do so while I was living here in New York I bought in Oakland and in New Orleans from a distance now how do you do that in order to do that one you have to know how to evaluate a market how do you know if a market is expanding or contracting and then once you've identified a market you have to go build your team there you have to go find a property manager you have to go find a real estate agent whose eyes you trust literally my property in Oakland California I've never set foot inside of it I've never set foot inside my property in Oakland California because I had trusted eyes and when I buy I don't buy based on emotions this is not HGTV I don't need to like the property or what it looks like on the inside I buy based on economics okay so when you can move with that kind of confidence when you're evaluating deals even when you are seeing them from a distance um, that is the power because the only thing that beats a cash offer is a fast offer so the reality is, is many of you know how to invest from a distance you own Amazon stock and you've never been to Seattle you own Nike stock you've never been to Beaverton you own Apple stock you've never been to Cupertino so you know what it means for your money to work in a different city than you do so if you are confined to a very expensive market like New York City San Francisco Los Angeles etc that does not have to stop you from being a real estate investor you know oh uh, yeah there's bondage here if you are making six figures in New York you still may be in bondage okay so um, you don't have to stay that way and the only way to get out of bondage is not through just make, making more active income but through creating passive income and the best way I've found to create passive income that comes in consistently forever and ever and ever the number one subscription business in the entire world is multifamily real estate so uh, again you do not have to be bound to giving up on your real estate investing dreams because you happen to be born in or live in or attached to a expensive market for whatever reason I know there's several reasons like family etc comfortability familiarity etc but you can invest from a distance where you are now the investment typically is 25% down but there are ways to work around that if you understand the game from a high level, all right? So if you want to learn how to do this, go to multifamilymasterplan.com. That's multifamilymasterplan.com. I'll show you how to finance, find, and finalize multifamily real estate deals just like this one. All right? Much love, y'all. Peace.